Hello my friends, this is Amber from DSA Threads, and today we're going to talk a little bit about the shoes that I made. I started out by looking at different examples from the 16th century of various shoes. I wanted to get an idea of how they might have done it. And then I also looked on Francis Class's website, which is fantastic. It's called Raised Heels. And I found a pattern for a turn shoe that looked like something I could potentially replicate with a starter pattern, which is from Champagne Fair. So the first thing that I did was I tried to make a mock-up from the pattern until I got something that was relatively close to what I wanted and the fit I wanted. Don't use pins, use the clips. Then I made one roughly with the extra faux leather that I had just to see how it turned out and I was actually really happy with it. So then it was time for the embellishment. I found a picture of these show peens and the pattern on them is just so great. So I made my own pattern and started using a nail to hammer the small dots and then an X-Acto knife to do the lines since I do not have a punch. Then it was time for assembly. I attached the back piece to the front piece with the side seams. I did the side seams with a back stitch and then I whip stitched the seam allowance down. And then for around the opening, I just whip stitched it down. Then I attached the top pieces to the sole using these awesome clips. Then I stitched with a back stitch all the way around. The final stage is flipping the whole thing inside out, which you can do because of the softness of the material. This was really a fun project and the shoes are super comfy. They are definitely meant for indoors, but I still love them. And because of the soles that I used, probably a little bit more durable. Again, this is not a period accurate way of assembling a shoe from the time. I just wanted to make shoes and make them look a little bit, maybe inspired by. Thank you.